Good afternoon guys and happy Thursday to all of your sunshiny faces. Guys, Matthew's back for um, winter break. We've loaded up all of the stuff from his dorm, all of his stuff, all in the back seat of the um, SUV it was able to fit in there, luckily. Um, and he actually didn't take anything in the bug at all, which I was like, you could put the seat down and probably put like, you know, like his laundry basket or something back there. Um, but no, we loaded everything up in there. And so, um, plus, too so matthew is not feeling good he says that he has got like um like body aches sore throat you know the works <laughs> um and so i was like oh my gosh i hope you don't have whatever jack has because jack has yet to officially be diagnosed yet with mono still um i think they can test again like friday or something like that but they don't like you know he's um within the time frame that they probably would know um but jack's been on all of his medication and stuff like that and his cough sounds i'd say probably better than it did like a week ago um but he is still like um somewhat tired i mean he's still sick and everything like that but he seems way 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 better than he did um so i guess that's a good thing but um yeah he like I said, just kind of is out of it. Um, and then Matthew's sick too, which also, like I said, stinks. And Matthew was here on Monday, you know? So within three days, he literally came down with this now. Um, but he was able to at least finish all of his finals and everything like that while he wasn't sick. But I think, honestly, it literally came on pretty much today because he was like, oh, I don't feel good. And so we actually got to see what his dorm looked like because I wasn't there when he moved in because I was babysitting. Um, so I got to see what his dorm looked like because it was like, um, actually a whole different building than where he lived last year, which... I only saw once also um when he um we went to the the um football game we went to his dorm first um because we had to go get him and then he and my dad both had to go to the bathroom so then they ended up going back up and <laughs> did that um and then we were, ended up going to the game so um plus two i think he actually recorded in a vlog last year um when he was at his uh, dorm last year but this one was just like it's like a one room dorm but you share like the fridge and like the bathroom with like another roommate that has like one room also um so you don't have it with like technically you don't room or like sleep with a roommate um but you do like you have like it's like a pod and then um you share like a living area and like I guess sort of like a little kitchenette sort of thing um with like a few other people and then you have like one roommate that you share like the bathroom with um and like I said I think they had like a little fridge thing in there as well so again it was different than what he had last year um so I got to see that and now he's moving out and we'll be moving into his fraternity um at the end of like or the start of this year and he ha will have his own room I guess I believe is how it's working out too so anyways we got all his stuff taken out and taken care of and everything like that and like I said now he thinks he's sick which again hopefully is not the same thing that Jack has but it stinks that I mean he'll probably be sick for at least a good week which is going to push right up to Christmas and I am like, dear God, please do not let me get sick because I stinking had to suffer last year Christmas um, with that stomach flu that I had, which was horrible. And it was like literally like the week or whatever, right before Christmas. Um, and the thing was for Christmas and like even the day, like Christmas Eve, um, and I think the day before that or whatever, like I, I felt really good. The only problem was my stomach didn't still feel like 100%. So like we got like, you know, Christmas dinner and like breakfast and stuff like that. And I just like couldn't like, I didn't have like a taste for hardly anything. I really couldn't eat a whole lot either. So I had like little tiny bits, like we got Boston Market and I think I had like a few bites. Like I couldn't hardly eat my food. I couldn't enjoy it and it stunk. And I was like, please just like, I mean, I don't want to get sick at all, but like, like if if it came down to it and I had to I'm like please just let it be at least after Christmas because I don't want to suffer through Christmas like I did last year um even though again I wasn't sick on Christmas or anything like that but it still was like I wasn't 100% you know my stomach was still a little off 
Um, and so, like I said, I, I just, I didn't have a taste for every, anything. You guys know, like, when you're sick and you're just like, oh, like, you know, that, you know, it's like, my eyes, too, were so much bigger than my stomach. <laughs> like, I was like, oh my gosh, like, I totally want that. Like, you know, and I felt hungry, but it was like, once I got a few bites, I'm like, ugh, full already. You know, just because my stomach was so, like, you know, just, like, on the rock, sort of. It was just not, not settled. So, um, you know, like I said, Christmas was just kind of like a complete pain. And I didn't get to f celebrate Christmas with family either last year. I don't even remember where we had, um, or where they celebrated Christmas. Because, like I said, I wasn't there. I was home alone by myself with the dogs. And, like, I think I was throwing up pretty much. <laughs> so, it's like, yeah, that stunk. Because I think they celebrated Christmas the week before. But then last, or not last year, the year before that was when we went to my cousin's house, um, at her apartment. Um, and so that's why I keep thinking last year was that Christmas. So I'm like, no, I missed last Christmas. Like, I didn't even get to celebrate. So that's why I'm like, okay, can, maybe if I do get sick, can it be like after even January? Because we're supposed to be celebrating with family again, um, like at the beginning of January. So I really don't want to get sick. Um, and like I said, I am trying so hard, like hand sanitizer, um, like washing my hands, like mad person, you know, like anytime I am like, you know, involved in anything at all I'm like okay I gotta wash my hands I gotta wash my hands I gotta wash my hands <laughs> like you know even if I'm just gonna like go and like catch my water bottle I'm like I should wash my hands like you know um that kind of thing like I I'm, I've been a little paranoid with like washing my hands and and or sa hand sanitizer um you know using that so I'm <laughs> trying to trying to be a little bit um you know like I said just trying to avoid getting sick but then on top of that too I'm like okay take my vitamin C let's um you know I'm gonna eat all of my <laughs> you know, I'm gonna eat uh, there's cuties you know I was like okay those have vitamin C and I'm gonna eat some of those um like I said taking my vitamin C and everything like that plus my vitamins I'm like I don't want to get sick um and like you know if it is Jack has mono and that's you know what he has which like I said it seems like it's what he has yet he's yet to test positive for it um but if that is what he has like I said it's mainly through like um like saliva is how you're gonna get it um which was what my mom was saying um but still I'm like you know if he's coughing and stuff like that and his like cough and spit something and my water bottle happens to be there or you know like it gets on my hands or something like that you know and then I go to touch something like I don't know how like you know how much it's transferred and stuff um you know so I'm like oh, I just don't want to like get sick um you know like I said I'm just I'm trying to stay in my room but um then my mom was like earlier today she's like oh I think I'm getting sick actually earlier in the week I think when Tuesday or whatever when she took Jack to the doctor she thought she was gonna get sick too um or thought she was getting sick and she thinks maybe not even that it was a sinus infection but um I think from the heaters from like the dry heat you guys know I always complain about that too um but like she just like her she sounded all congested and stuff like that and she thought that she was like getting sick and she's like oh my throat feels like it's like you know like she was starting to get a sore throat and then I think that she just turned the heaters down in her bedroom um and she said that she hasn't felt like it hasn't felt like she's gotten a sore throat again so I guess that's good but and she's been tending to Jack mainly so I'm like if she she'd probably be the first one that like gets it um if anybody does so that's why I'm like I don't know that Matthew has what you know Jack had um which again he wasn't like around him I mean he's been around the least amount you know other than I mean they sleep in the same bedroom but you know they he hasn't been around Jack nearly as much as the rest of us because he's at school so that's why I'm like I don't like feel like you know maybe he is getting whatever Jack has um you know but I still feel like it'd be very very rare that you know he would get it and that Jack has so maybe just pick something up at school and it is like just a cold or something like that um but who knows <laughs> so yeah guys like I said I am like probably just gonna barricade myself in my room and like okay or tell them to barricade themselves in the room but um <laughs> stay away from me um but I need to go and actually get Christmas presents and really start focusing on Christmas presents this week guys because I need to figure out what I'm getting for everybody and if I am buying anything online like I need to really figure that out soon because shipping is like you know needs to be start you know becoming a priority because I don't want to wait till last minute and get stuff when it's not going to get here in time so 
yeah <laughs> that's why i want to check too to see like when stuff this is going to ship by um because you know there's one thing i had in mind for my mom and two things actually um but again both those things are probably online things and so i need to figure out when they're going to ship by so anyway so guys yeah i need to start focusing on that too um and then because my dad and me are probably going to go out christmas shopping this weekend um but the problem is is that like i might have to do almost all my shopping because if matthew's sick he might not be able to then go with um like if he he wanted to take me Matt, me jack and himself to go shopping but obviously like i said if he's sick then it's gonna stink so even if he isn't it lasts for a few days like that's gonna push kind of close close ish to christmas because it is the end of you know we have next week and then the following week's christmas so um you know and it's sort of towards the end of this week already but i did actually upload today guys the only problem was was that i was using the new upload for youtube and i don't know how to upload multiple videos at the same time i tried to like it was like oh just drag your files um or like you can select them or whatever so i tried to do that it wasn't letting me select multiple and it wasn't letting me drop multiple i don't know actually if you can do it or not um i have to figure that out if not i'm going to go back to the old youtube setting just so that i can get like a bulk of the videos that i need uploaded uploaded because i got two done today because i was super confused with how it was working and then on top of that too it was telling me it was taking forever to process for some reason and i was like okay well let me just try and get through the first video that wasn't processing and then eventually it did um and then i got through the second one and then it was stuck on like 99 percent and i was like okay is it gonna finish and then it did and i was like okay you know what let me just try and do it the old way then. I didn't end up getting to any more though. Because we had to go and get Matthew. Which like I said ended up taking two hours. I think over two hours. is so like closer to three hours. Between driving there. Which is almost an hour. Getting all his stuff. Picking him up. Getting back in the car and driving. Then we stopped at Wendy's. And then ended up coming back almost closer to three hours. That I spent literally doing nothing productive. So um, sat in the car and listened to Christmas carols. Anyway, so guys, I will see you all in tomorrow's vlog. If you guys did enjoy today's, make sure you guys give a big old thumbs up. If you guys are new, we'd love if you'd subscribe. And I'll see all of your sunshiny faces tomorrow. So bye, guys.